good day friends it is me HL Mod Tech and I am back with another quick video about Tinkercad so let's get cracking I am starting friends on my website hlmodtech.com I've got a page dedicated to Tinkercad with tons of amazing categories and then also the built for beginners section where I give you a list of fantastic projects if it's your first time using Tinkercad no matter which one of these pick, you will learn a ton of skills that will help you for all the rest of your Tinkercad creations. Before we go into actual projects though, I want to show you what I call the Designer Showcase, which also houses the Designer Directory with tons of amazing Tinkercad user profiles. Friends, when you click on one of these, you will get a view of that user's design sorted by likes. When you click on one of these, you can click and give them a reaction for the creation that they've made. Now, if it's one of my creations, you'll notice there is quite often a tutorial up here, so you could actually make your own awesome version of that project. Now, friends, I want to remind you to also sort by recent. Friends, when you click on these, if you see a project you like, make sure you click on it and give a reaction that fits how you're feeling about the project. Now, you may notice that all of my projects say no derivative works. This is due to me saying attribution, no derivatives when I make these public. I do that because I don't want you to just copy my design. I want you to follow the tutorial, which I've found helps users get a lot more skills. Real quickly, let me show you a tutorial included project that does let you copy and tinker. And I want to remind you, friends, this is one of the biggest rules of Tinkercad. Always give a reaction before you copy and tinker. Now, I personally think this thing is absolutely awesome, so I'm going to give it an awesome. And then when you hit copy and tinker, you actually enter the project that the user shared with you, and you can tear it apart and learn what they built. Now, mine is not a tear apart project. Mine is actually a build. If you check the properties, this tutorial actually teaches you how to make an awesome log cabin in just a few minutes. A ton of fun, but I do also want to emphasize once again, Give those reactions before you hit copy and tinker. Friends, I'm about to teach you about reactions, but before I do, let me show you how you can start getting reactions. If you complete a project, like I made this little vent adapter, you need to go to the properties and you need to give it a good name. You should give it a good description. You should give it some tags. Here you can see I quickly filled in that mine has a tutorial. I added my tags and then here's where I make it public. And once again, because I want you to follow the tutorial, I'm going to say attribution, no derivatives. If I were just giving you projects to tear apart, I would not choose this. But since I want you to follow tutorials, bang, I've done that. Now, once you've made public projects, eventually you'll start getting notifications. If you click up here and you click notifications, you will see all the things that have happened. Now you can see here, my alt, the roar, opened that project just a few minutes ago and gave a reaction of awesome. Now what I always do is if you give me a reaction, I always hit open in a new tab, I check out your designs, and then I give you a reaction as well. Now I already gave this a reaction, but I'm gonna switch it to a wow, just so that you can see that I saw that you checked out my designs. It's a fun way to share the love as you're checking out other people's Tinkercad creations. Friends, real quickly on those notifications, check it out. I can see these users copied my project but did not give a reaction. It is so much cooler if you take a moment to give a reaction so the users know that you're appreciating their shared work. Now down here I can see I got a reaction from S. Alderman. As usual, totally appreciate that and once again like I showed a moment ago, I will open your projects. I will sort by recent. Now friends, as I look at the work of S. Alderman, I have liked so many designs but check it out because I sorted as recent. I can see this one that is a remix of a drawing contest. That is unbelievably cool and I'm giving it a wow. Now one thing I want to mention that I really appreciate, the reactions are all positive. This goes back to one of those things your mother would say, if you don't have something nice to say, just don't say anything at all. If you come in here, take a moment to appreciate people's work, give them a reaction and then just scoot on. Being critical of other people's work, so just make sure you're always pushing the conversation 
towards positive. So I'm gonna go back to my main page and I'm gonna switch to the gallery. Now the first time you launch the gallery, you will see the staff picks. These are awesome. Make sure if you like what they made, you give them a reaction. I think those are pretty darn adorable. You have to go back. So I'm gonna use my back browser button to get back here. And then I'm gonna switch to recent. Friends, once a week, I like to just jump in here and check out the cool designs that are just being created. So this right here is an original. If you wait a moment, it loads. I think those are pretty cool creations, so I'm going to give them a like. Once again, you can just go back. You can switch to the larger grid so you can see more designs. When you find something you think is awesome, just make sure you click up here and give it a reaction. Friends, I'm going to wrap up back at my website. Don't forget, it is hlmodtech.com. Tons of amazing lessons on the Tinkercad tab. And then also, down at the bottom, a sweet built-in messaging tool. You can click that button, add your question, comment, or suggestion, and reach me almost instantly. Friends, if you look up at the top, you will also find a link to the Tinkercad Community Discord. As you can see, there are more than 500 members, and it is a fantastic place to talk everything Tinkercad. Lastly, friends, I want to remind you, have a ton of fun with Tinkercad and also take time to share those cool projects so we can all give you awesome reactions. Friends, of course, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. Please also hit that share button so more people can learn about HL Mod Tech. Of course, if you got a question, comment, or suggestion, add it down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me. HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.